Hi, I'm Paddy from windowanddoorparts.ie and in this video I'm going to show you how to replace the window a spag lock in a UPVC window. So we can see here that when we close the handle to lock the window it doesn't do anything. This is because the window lock is broken. Now there's a couple of things to check to order the right size window lock. The first size we're going to measure is the back set. This is the distance from the edge of the window lock to the center of the handle. I'm marking it here with biro just so we can see clearly. We can see here the back set is 20 millimeters. The next thing we want to do is look along the face plate of the window lock. We can see here the manufacturer's name, Mila. And if we look down a little bit further, we'll see this code. It says GR60. This is the length of the window lock. The next thing to do is to remove the window lock. To do this, remove the two screws holding the handle and remove the handle. Remove the screws along the face plate of the lock. We can see here the lock has completely fallen apart. Now this lock is not being manufactured by Miele anymore. It's been replaced by the new Miele spag lock. Now the locking points are slightly different on the new version of the lock. This will mean moving the receivers and the frame to suit the new positions. This is available in 20mm and 22mm back sets. Alternatively, we can use the Howtow window lock. This is identical to the old Miele window lock, but it's only available in 19mm or 22mm back sets. However, the 19mm back set lock will work in place of the 20mm back set lock. Now I'm installing the new Miele Spag lock so I can show you the repositioning of the receivers in the frame. But this will be the same process for every window lock. So fit the window lock into the recess and line it up with the screw holes. Note that I fitted the handle in the closed position and tried to open it to the right and the handle doesn't move. This is because the window lock is in the open position but the handle is in the closed position. So I'm going to open the handle to the open position and refit it. We can see here now that the position is correct. Next fit the two screws holding the handle. Next we're going to fit the screws along the face plate of the lock. The screws I'm using here are PVC window screws. Now we can see here the position of the rollers in the new lock. We can see that the receiver is down too low and is actually stopping the window from closing. So we're going to move this receiver up a fraction. To do this, remove the two screws and simply move the receiver up. Open and close the lock a few times to make sure the position is right. And refit the two screws. We can see now that the position of the receiver is correct for the new lock. We're going to do the very same process on the bottom receiver. When we close and lock the window we can see here that it's locking tight on the top and bottom. And that's how to replace the window lock in a UPVC window. 